everyone, I'm Winnie and welcome to my video where I'm doing a speed paint of Fitzroy Avery Wrecker from Keeper of the Lost Cities. Usually I just add a chill background music to my speed paints but today I'm feeling extra chatty. Also please excuse my pronunciations and slang as English is not my first language. I haven't done a speed paint video for a whole year so thank you for those of you who stuck around especially those who left really sweet and encouraging comments on my old and embarrassing videos. If you're here from my Instagram or Tumblr, hi there! I've actually recorded other speed paint videos last year, but the art qualities are really unsatisfactory, so I wasn't motivated to post any videos, especially after the Biana speed paint. Um, I hope I'm pronouncing her name correctly. <laughs> So what should I ramble about? This is a one-take thing, so I'll just talk whatever comes to mind. Um, I think in this fandom, I'm basically the shy and quiet kid who silently dumps my art onto Instagram and Tumblr at random intervals. So I really admire artists or content creators who can just post or interact with fellow Keeper fans consistently. Like, where do you guys get that energy? I'm sorry, I'm just a really shy and low energy person, but I do enjoy interacting with all of you. And speaking of fandom, I think the Keeper fandom is just rapidly growing, and oh my gosh, there's going to be a movie. I don't know how the movie will turn out, but I'm definitely looking forward to it. And super happy for Miss Shannon Messenger. So yay for us old Keeper fans, and also welcome in advance to new Keeper fans who will discover this awesome book series from the movie. I started reading the books in, I think, 2016, which was when Lodestar just came out. I was drawn to Lodestar's gorgeous cover and this is how I ended up reading the whole series. Shout out to Jason Chan for being such a talented and amazing artist. Yes, I know you're not supposed to judge a book by its cover, but it's so pretty I couldn't help myself. The series is really enjoyable, although I'm not exactly the intended age group or the targeted demographic. Mm, I ended up creating tons of fan art because I just really love the books, the characters and also the fandom. Also looking back at my old fan art makes me go ugh and ew, but it also drives me to improve further. Besides, I get to make many awesome friends here. You know who you are. So here I'm painting Fitz, I hope I'm pronouncing his name correctly too, cause why are the record names so fancy? He is one of the main characters of this series, which you are probably going to be like, yeah, we know that. This piece is inspired by eating mooncakes from Tumblr, who posted that they like to see a fluster or embarrassed Fitz. I was asked on several occasions on why do I paint Fitz with a tan or darker skin tone. It's pretty much a stylistic choice and just how I picture him in my mind, which may be different from how you or others imagine him to look like. What are your thoughts on Fitz? I know many of us adore him, and some may dislike him due to certain traits or reasons. I personally adore all the Keeper kids, Fitz is no exception, and I hope he'll get further character development in the next book, especially on how he'll improve as a person and learn to control his anger. Which I find to be very relatable as I was once a teenager myself who had trouble controlling my anger or frustrations. Now I'm just a chill young adult who likes to read this middle grade book series and make fan art. I think that's enough ram rambling from me. I'm not a talkative person so this is probably my daily limit for the amount of words spoken. If you're still here, thank you for listening all the way and <laughs> have I not bored you to death yet? Do let me know in the comments if you prefer just normal background music instead of me talking, which I know is boring, unless you'd like to suggest interesting Keeper topics for me to discuss. Not promising anything though, because we know how inconsistent I am at posting videos or even art because of how busy I am. I'll probably look back at this video in a few years and think about, oh my god, this is so awkward. But hey, it's fun monologuing to all of you. I hope you've enjoyed this speed paint of fits. Thank you for watching and listening. Bye!
Thank you.